Hey guys, what is up? This is AJ here, bringing another Pokemon Souls over in Nuzlocke Challenge. So, uh, last time we were talking about um, Black Ops 2, and then we kind of developed into me being psychic, because I, for some reason I know all of these Pokemon that are uh, before they even pop out, because, uh, I don't know, because I've played this game too many times. It doesn't even show it in my booklet. It doesn't even show the Pokemon Trainer Pokemon in the booklet, so I know that I just, ugh, whatever, but, um, what I wanted to state in the last episode, but, uh, I wanted to wait until this episode, was the new My Little Pony Season 3 opener, and, yeah, amazing, honestly, just, ah, it was really, really good, if you have a friend that's not very much into My Little Pony. And so, yeah, just uh, show them that. But honestly, I love it. It was really good, but it did not compare to the Season 2 finale because the Season 2 finale was just phenomenal. I don't know how they did it, but they just made it absolutely amazing. Um, I was hoping they would be able to pass it up with uh, this season 3 opener, but they didn't, but I'm still very, very impressed. It was, it was really good. It was, um, it was, um, I wouldn't even say it was just as good as, um, the season 2 finale, but I think it was, uh, better than the season 2 opener, which is, uh, really good. Um, so yeah, it was uh, just, just amazing. Um, so pretty much it was about, uh, uh, the Crystal Empire, which sounds epic automatically, and, uh, the main six has to go over there and, uh, save everyone, and, yeah. The only thing I don't like is that the, the, the evil guy, the, the main evil guy that, uh, you don't really see him, you see him a lot. Like, you do. I, I, I'm not going to complain about that. But I'm saying that, like, you don't really know much about him. You don't know anything. Like, um, you only know that he was emperor of uh, the... He uh, took over and was emperor of the Crystal uh, Empire for a while. And then, um, right when he was defeated by Celestia and Luna... He, um, the whole empire vanished, and then now it reappeared. Uh, it was really good, but the only thing that I don't like is that he, you don't really know about much about him, and then you don't really know much about, uh, uh, like, uh, I don't know. It, it, it's like, I don't know, like, they, they didn't really go deep into the, the, the evil character like they did with um, uh, Chrysalis because she she was an epic um, enemy and I don't know it was just epicness I guess so yeah and then I don't know ah, I'm thinking but it was it was really good it was still really good and um, uh, they did make it kind of close, and, um, I'm not going to spoil it for whoever hasn't watched it, uh, even though I, I, I really bet that everyone that, uh, that watches this don't really watch My Little Pony, which I should get more viewers that are My Little Pony related, because that'd be awesome, because then I could share more of my, My Little Pony intelligence. I'm actually watching, wearing, um... Uh, Pinkie Pie shirt too. I'm wearing it. It's like says forever and it has Pinkie Pie and um, If you are a fan of the series you would know what forever means in this in one of the episodes So yeah, I'm I'm a die-hard po po pony fan And I, I'm not even setting a good example for myself. I just feel like a nerd I am a nerd actually because I'm playing Pokemon I like My Little Pony, I draw, and, wait, would I be considered a hipster, or 
a nerd. I think I'd be considered a nerd. I mean, uh, well, I don't play video games that much. I watch TV a lot. And I'm not very good at, at math and stuff. And, well, a lot of people aren't good at math, but you know what I mean. Like, I'm not very good at, um, uh, I'm not very good at work. I don't know. I'm really, really lazy. So, that's a thing. I don't know. I, I don't even... I wouldn't consider myself a hipster. Because I don't really want to be a hipster. Because that... Those people kind of seem like wannabes. Even though, like, they don't really want to be wannabes. But they... they no, they want to be wannabes. But... That... <laughs> So I heard you want to be a wannabe, so I want to be your wannabe, so we can want to be together. <laughs> oh my god, I don't even know what I'm saying. But yeah, I, I, don't, I don't, I'd rather be a nerd for some reason. Is that bad? Because, I don't know. Nerds, nerds are fun. Because uh, we get to, we get to be ca classified already. We don't really have to impress anyone. And we, uh... Can just do whatever we want and hipsters they're constantly trying to impress people and they're trying to come up with always something new and i don't know it's just it's just bad i, I think they kind of try to be hipster so a hipster is a person that tries to be different well yeah that's that's pretty much what states a hipster but yeah um I don't even know where I'm going with this. I kind of went off a random tangent. I think it went off of My Little Pony to hipsters. They kind of coincide. Well, at first. Now it's just kind of like, um, more mellow. And down below, people don't really watch the show. I, I don't know. It doesn't seem like a lot of people watch the show anymore, but they're probably not just out there a lot anymore. But, uh, I certainly am. Because, uh, I really don't care who believes that I am a brony or not a brony. Because it doesn't really matter to me. Because who really, who really cares about whatever the people think? I don't. So, yeah. And, uh, if you're, if you are against another religion and stuff like that, um, especially if you're Catholic, because in the Bible, it says... That only God can, uh, only God can judge. So, um, when you're saying, oh, gays shouldn't marry, or, um, marijuana shouldn't be legal, or these people are, are stupid, um, their beliefs are stupid, you, you really can't say anything because in the Bible it states that you can't really say anything bad to them you have to be kind to your neighbors Ooh, and I guess it's hard for people um, I'm not really Catholic my mom's Catholic and she believes that which I'm glad because if she didn't then I would be very very different probably or the same and I would probably turn a little bit psycho I am a little bit psycho but even more a little bit psycho but, uh, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Uh, Montano just grew a level, and he's level 20. Yes, Montano is gaining levels like a boss. Um, I want Montano to be at least, like, level 25 before I get to this next gym. Because I think their Pokemon are level 30. Yeah. I think when I remember... Facing them. I think they were level 30. I'll look in my book right now. I don't want to guess. Because I don't want to get it wrong either. Okay. So. And. We defeated that guy. Already passed Goldenrod. Already beat Whitney. That's way behind. Man, book, you're so behind. Um, past that. Uh, past that. Okay, in all of Iron City. Okay. Um, go to the lighthouse, you talk to what's her face. Oh, do I face her 